All right, hello everybody and welcome to definitely my favorite game this year, guys. Bandle Tale is super duper awesome. I've been enjoying every single second of this game ever since I discovered it. And uh, man, I'm having a blast with this one. Now, if you guys haven't checked out the game yet, make sure you check out my previous episodes. They are super duper awesome. This is such an enjoyable little game. I, I just have no other words for that. I have no other words. Now, before we're going to jump into the adventure here, let me actually make my way into the bed. Uh, because we do have to... Come on, buddy. What are you doing? Uh, we do have to rest up. And, of course, get some of these points into my character. Uh, so we can hopefully expand our uh, skill tree a little bit more. Now, let me see. We also have to find a Vager for some reason. Let me go into the skill tree for a second. And let me figure out if I need to unlock anything more. Nope. I need to unlock more badges, of course, if I want to unlock more abilities. Uh, because everything else has been unlocked by the looks of it. And, oh, never mind. This one needs to be unlocked, but I need a little bit more skill. So, that being said, let me go into my farm. Uh, add. There we go. Let's collect a little bit of banana. I love it that we can also expand our backpack. This is just the best thing ever. The fact that you can expand the backpack, it's awesome. Okay, let's go here. Grab this. Grab this. Add more. Perfect. Grab this bad boy. Add more. Okay, add this in here, add this in here, and I think we're good to go. All right, let's keep it going. So, let us see here. Um, report to Tristana, Detective Tristana. Find Vigor. So, I got to report to Tristana what we just discovered. Also, uh, we are going to have to bring ink to this lady. I have no idea where to get ink from, though, to be honest. I really have no idea where to get the ink from. Uh, let me see if I can report to Tristana then, what we discovered, and uh, see what's going to happen next. I absolutely love this game. This is just so well done. So well done. Uh, I should have gotten myself my backpack. If I do want to explore some more, I definitely need to get myself... Oh, the dust scooper thingamajig broke. Uh, dang it. I'm going to have to make a new one. Yeah, I completely forgot that tools can break. Anyway... Let me have a chat with her real fast. Never mind. I cannot have a chat with her. Wait, what is that? Did I interact with this previously? Oh, a flask workbench repair. So I need a repair multi-tool. Uh, hold up. Let me go into my inventory again, which is this one. And let's fix it. There we go. <gasps> can make rich soil or levitating potions with this. Huh. I mean, I don't need the levitating potions because... Uh, yeah, look at that. It can make a lot of stuff here. That is awesome. Uh, I already have the levitating potion, which means I can go ahead and levitate these things. Right? This rock is too big to move this way. Oh, I, I know that, buddy. But don't I have the levitating potions on me? Hold up. I do have them. What do I do with them, though? That is my question. I think I gotta leave the uh, artifact here back home because um, I cannot really carry it with me. Alright, let's see what other missions we have then. Um, craft levitated potions in flask workbench. Six out of three. I already crafted that. Admission exam. Wait, am I supposed to chat with somebody about the levitated potion that I just crafted? No. I'm confused. What am I supposed to do then? Uh, I mean, the mission is showing me to go over here, but I've already made levitating potion, so I'm not quite sure what this is all about. Hold up, buddy. Levitating potions. One. Oh! Clean up Big Rob from Bandle University. There we go. So now we can clean them up. Yeah, for some reason, I already had what I needed. Uh, it was just not working. <laughs> oh, I love that you gotta... <laughs> you gotta levitate them. That is so cool. Now it's a... Wait, what? Wait, what? The rock is... The rock is talking to me? Oh, I've got things to say, all right? This potion of yours might have worked on simple rocks, but such uh, but such shoddy measures won't rid you of the Philosopher's Stone. <laughs> what the heck? I mean, me. I was talking third person. 
Can I somehow convince you to leave the market? I really need to clean it for some for something. Maybe you can, but only if you don't go too far away. I spend my time pondering life, the universe, and the lification of sentiments. And this place is really good for thinking. <laughs> okay, I'll try to find a way to tie you down here. So, what's the plan? Honestly, no idea. I've never helped a uh, talking stone. <laughs> You're still surprised by talking in uh, intimate objects? Well, I'm sensitive, okay? <laughs> How about rope? Oh, just tie the rock down so they don't fly away to uh, infinity. Then you can move them anywhere, uh, like to a rock garden or something. Hmm. Talking is one thing, but I never get uh, used to inmate objects being this smart. Oh, stop it, you. That's problem solving 101. <laughs> Oh man, okay, I gotta get me a um a rope apparently. <laughs> this game, dude, never ceases to amaze me. I was not expecting the rock to talk. What the heck? I was just so confused when he started talking. I thought it was something else. But no, everything in this game talks. Everything has a soul. All right, hold up. Uh, let me go this way. I'm actually also, also gonna get my backpack to be honest and move it somewhere else. Uh, I'll roll. Ooh, what the heck? What is that? I don't even know what this is. Hold up a minute. We got a basic worm bench there that we can use if you don't want to go inside the house. That is so cool. All right, let's remove the backpack. There we go. Uh, I have to bring rope. What other missions do we have? Bring parchment and ink, which I don't have, of course. And find Vega. Where the heck is even Vega, though? I have no clue where Vega is. He's definitely not around here. I haven't seen him before. I haven't seen him around. Yeah, Vega is definitely not here. All right, let me solve this problem that we have right now. And I'm going to place the uh, backpack over there and expand it then. Because I also have to go inside, of course, to get some sleep and all that jazz. So, let us see here. Uh, place the backpack. Let me go ahead and make myself a rope. Wait, don't I have a rope in here? No. There's the rope. And now, tie the rock down. <laughs> this place seems decent. Okay. Hope you'll have lots of great thoughts here. <laughs> awesome. Hey, the, the uh, quest is done. There we go. Which means I'm going to be able to expand some more now. Perfect. All right. We got rid of the uh, rocks. Let me go back. Uh, well, we'll add it. let me also go in here to collect more garbage. Why not? There's a lot of trash around here that we can collect. Just like that. There we go. Hey, and now that we're done with the rocks, look at that. We can actually have a chat with these fellas. Can I not become a student, I wonder? You're being absolutely preposterous, Dr. Tangent. You're using random words from dictionary, Dr. Alma. Hi. <laughs> I've cleaned the islands. Indeed, it looks great. The work of a true engineer. That is completely another nonsense. That is a dedicated creative at heart. The way you solved the Philosopher's Stone problem was so elegant. So you can reopen your classes, right? Hmm. Actually, there's one more tiny, tiny problem. What problem? The knowledge collection is missing. And there's no way we could um, rekindle the eternal flame of knowledge uh, without it. Unless... Cut to the chase. Well, you don't need it, right? We didn't even have that kind of knowledge before the catastrophe. Wouldn't that be just the most glorious way to rebuild our missing collection? Incredible. I actually agree with you. <laughs> If you teach our students about uh, knitting, well, we'll be more than happy to take you in a student as a student. Okay, I guess I can give you a lecture. Splendid. Thanks. Wait, am I about to become a uh, professor myself? Are you kidding me? Well, don't mind if I do, buddy. Uh, and look at that. We can now also unroll here if you want to. I don't even know what this is because apparently I gotta place some stuff on that side. Uh, use. I wonder what. Basic workbench. Look at that. Huh. 
Um, let me just head inside for a second. Let me leave the uh, glasses over here as I'm not going to need them. This guy's going to stick with me, right? Yeah, because I actually don't need it just yet. What I got to do, though, I got to make another one of those uh, tools that broke. Which, unfortunately, I don't think I can make because I no longer... Yeah, I no longer have uh, paper. Spooling, loom, crusher workbench, speed crafter. So many things that we still have to make. Wait, was he here? Assembly bench. We got all these. We can make that into crystals. Oh, right. We need a thread, right? Wait, what? What did I even take? I don't even know what I took there. Uh, iron and stone. Hold up. Give me a minute here. Okay, so I wanted all these. I did have quite a bit of rope. Uh, I could have just grabbed it from here, I guess. I messed it up. That's fine. Uh, let's grab these as well. These are going to be for farming instead. That's why I need them all over here. Let's put that for farming. That's going to be for farming. Um, I guess that is about it for now. Let's grab this. Add another one. I love that you're basically grabbing stuff straight from the chest. That is just so good that it works like this. Right, hold up. Uh, get rid of that, 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 and that. Perfect. Okay. So, now let me go into this chest and get rid of some stuff. So I don't have to carry this stuff with me. Okay. Much, much better. Okay. I wish I could actually interact with this little buddy, though. Fortunately, we can now really do that. So, let me get some sleep. Get some more XP because I know I need it. There we go. Uh, let me go into the skill menu, because now we can actually go with the basic blueprint skill. Awesome. Okay, that one is done. Uh, next, which one has been unlocked? I think this one, right? Yep. Nope, not, not this one. Uh, this is the path that has been unlocked. Right over here. So, I can make a big home upgrade. Ooh. And a basic merchant. You know what? I want the big home upgrade because this is probably going to allow me to kind of expand my house even more. And if you expand your house even more, of course, that means more stuff. So let's see what we can do to expand. We can make a chill zone. Look at that. I need resources again. Uh, okay, so if I want to expand this one, I need blueprint. How do you even make blueprints? So I need one blueprint and three pieces of material. Which I have no clue how to make as well. Assembly bench. How do you even make that stuff? Oh, ink! We can make ink! Finally! There we go! Alright, we finally made ink. Finally. So that is done. Uh, let's leave that do its thing. Let's also... Hold up. Let's also get... I don't know. 20 of these? Yeah. Let's put them over there so they uh, do their thing. Uh, this one, what do I have to craft here? Nothing because I already have everything that I need on this side. I think I need a dust scooper, which means I need wood. Yeah, so uh, if I need wood, I cannot craft it in here, actually. Assembly bench, I need a blueprint. Okay. Let me grab this. Use. Uh, let's make 20 of these. There we go. Let them do their thing. Okay. Uh, uh, okay, let me go and bring the materials. Here. Oh, wait, what? Oh, you can now collect paper. What? There we go. Uh, awesome. Man, this game. I love it. Love it so much. It is not really... You guys know that I always look for really, really awesome gems, right? Out there to play and uh, enjoy. And I feel like this is such an amazing game. More people should know about it. I haven't really seen developers um, advertising it too much, though, for some reason. Although it's such a special game. Such a special game, and I'm pretty sure not many people are going to know about it. Yeah, developers definitely didn't really... Um, 
put up too much marketing for this one. But uh, hopefully my videos here are gonna guys uh, gonna make you guys realize that this game is definitely something you guys want to check out for sure. It is just super super amazing. Um, what's this? Oh, I'm guessing that's paper. Yeah, never mind. Okay, hold up. Let me go and give the paper and the ink to Penelope, and uh, finish up with this quest. Hold up, Penelope. LP. I'm coming. There you go. What about you? Can I get a scoop in the Bandle Center newest, most mysterious yodel? No, here you go. Let's start our need of view then. Uh, what can it tell us about the portal mess? Hmm, it probably shouldn't tell her I held the yarn. That may sound too suspicious. I'm just trying to say, my friends, that got lost in the chaos. Hmm, but it was you who got me and Gerbo under the rubble, right? Which means you've had to be in the center of it all. Well, um, how could I be in the center of attention next to such a brilliant journalist? <laughs> Are you planning to get me off the scent? Well, I... <laughs> because it's working, I'm brilliant. Thanks, darling. <laughs> and on the other note, I think uh, that's a wrap. <laughs> uh, thanks for the exclusive. Here, take my old vending carpets. Now you can sell goods anywhere in Bandle City. Yodels will shower you with stars if you sell special crafts. Thank you again. What? Look at that, we can actually buy blueprints from them. That is so cool. And we got this quest upgrade a little bit more. Awesome, awesome. All right, what else are you guys selling? Um, what I need are these things, to be honest, clay, because I cannot really, ooh, a rock salt. I don't even know what that is. But I want it. Let's get five of them. Shop. Okay, another thing that I want to check out and see, uh, I got to figure out how to collect me clay. Uh, definitely going to need that eventually, right? But I don't know exactly what I need for this. So I need to make a clay pump. That's what I got to unlock. Okay, these are not ready to collect. So that being said, let me see if I can figure out how to get some clay pump. Uh, and at the same time, let me also get some greenery here. Oh, they're not ready to collect either. Never mind. Consider this, you and I can both look at the world and say, that's green. But your green and my green might look completely different. There's no way to know if we're seeing the same thing. <laughs> um, right. <laughs> okay, attach the vending carpet using outdoor building. Hold up. Let's see if I can do that. And maybe this way we can sell some stuff. Uh, I think, first of all, hold up, let me collect some water here, or liquid, whatever that is. Use vending carpets. There we go. Uh, when you add an item to the machine, simply wait until someone buys the item, then you can pick up your stars. Selling goods, uh, or not only earn stars, but refills the island scores. By operating the vending machine and decorating the carpet, you can improve your sales income. Ooh. Hold up a minute, uh, roll. Which one is it? Oh, is it? Oh, I think this is the market, right? This is so cool. Yeah, look at that. A vending machine. I can sell potions. All of them. And fireworks as well. That is so cool. Um, and I also can do the big home upgrade once I'm gonna have the resources, right? Uh, but first... I cannot really place anything in here. Hmm. And I also don't really have that many items to sell. Now, I wonder, hold up. What if I go in here, for example, and I grab some of the materials that I may need? Also, maybe the artifacts as well might be something that I can get. I don't know. Maybe some seeds can also be sold? I don't know. We can try. We can try and see if that's gonna be a thing. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see, real fast. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, okay, so you can sell these ones as well by the looks of it. Wait, why can I not add it? I can only add, what?
Yeah, I... How do you start it? I'm confused. Uh, I'm confused how the shop works. Um, give knitting lessons at the Bandle University. So that's my next mission. But I'm not sure exactly how to trigger the shop here. How do you start it? Um. Oh, you can have multiple things unraveled. That is so cool. Hmm. I really have no idea how to get the shop open, to be honest. <laughs> Am I just supposed to leave it like this? Oh yeah, I think you're just supposed to leave it like this and eventually it's gonna get sold and then you can go ahead and collect your stars. I think that's how it works. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Um, in that case, let me collect all of these. Let me collect all of these. And let me make some wood as well. Let's make 10 wood here. Okay. Let's add that. Okay, hold up. Let's give it us some stuff. I thought I could sell more here, but apparently not. So, ooh. Okay. Uh, what I want to do is remove this from here and this because I'm going to put them somewhere else in this chest instead. Kind of like trying to be organized a little bit with my uh, my items. So that is going to sit there. Okay, that's good. Cool, cool, cool. I wish I could actually interact with this little buddy, but I cannot for some reason. All right, now that we have the wood, uh, what did I need it to do? Shopping table. I also have to figure out how to make the fabric. It can be built using outdoor buildings, increased size of the backpack. Yeah, I know that. Basic junk spooling bench loom. <gasps> I think I need the loom to make the um, the things. Yes, hold up. I don't have any spots to place it in here though. So I could basically go in here, maybe, and place the Lumi here. I cannot place the Lumi here. Take it. Um, okay, in that case, I'm just going to place the Lumi outdoors. Yeah, because I have no other place to put it. There we go. Awesome. And while we're at it, I'm also going to go ahead and sleep, reset, just to get some more experience. we go we got 18 perfect let's get some more wood and let me also get 10 metal okay and with the loom hey we can make a lot of cloth let's make 20 cloth perfect that is so good hey look at that and we have 10 stars we can collect no way yeah that is so cool wait how do you Oh my god, that is so, so cool. And I can also sell, of course, the levitating things as well. That is awesome. I love it. I love that you don't have to do anything about the shop. You just set it up and uh, you let it do its thing. <gasps> I did not want to unroll that. Keep on rolling, buddy. Keep on rolling. Because I need the cloth. Now, how much cloth do I need uh, to upgrade? I need uh, three cloth. Oh, but I also need the blueprint. How do you make the blueprint? That is the question. Hmm... So, for the blueprint, what do we need? How do you make it? Crusher workbench. Oh, if I make stone, I can make a crusher workbench. Wait, isn't this a crusher workbench? Yes, it is. But, um... Seed crafter. Bug. Hold up, I think I may need to upgrade my character a little bit. So, let me go into my skill tree. Find craft merchants. I don't know what this is. A basic merchant and fine craft. Okay, so these are two craftsmanships. Uh, let's actually hold up. Let's see what else we can unlock. Nature. 
Which one did I unlock? These are still locked, yeah, for the magic. These are also locked. That one is also locked. I gotta figure out how to... And the Dust Scooper multi-tool. We also have to make ourselves a Dust Scooper multi-tool. Um... Did I go this way? No. Festivals. Unlock festivals for a few points. Unlock this. And if I want to unlock this one, I need more. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Looking good so far. Unlocked a couple more things. I think this one is unlocked, yeah? It definitely looks... Yeah, this one is definitely unlocked. So now, I will be able to go for Student Mixer. But I, of course, I need more XP. Okay, we got some materials here. Uh, this one's gonna keep on selling. I gotta wait for it to be done. Basic workbench. The loom is doing its thing. A chill zone and a dance floor. But uh, this is for uh, the festival carpet. Yeah, not for this one. Speedy vending machine upgrades. I don't even know what that is. How do you make blueprints, though? Oh, you know what I should do? I should probably go ahead and buy me some blueprints. Yeah. I should definitely try to do that. Because I really need it to make the uh, big home upgrade. Okay, let me see if I can go buy me some blueprints then. Uh, get that, get that. And I'm also gonna, after that, I'm gonna... Try to do the uh, curses for the students there. And teach the students how to weave. Alright, uh, I think you were selling the blueprints, right? Yes, she is, but she actually requires a lot of stars. Which, unfortunately, we do not have at the moment. Okay, never mind. I'm gonna have to sell a lot of stuff then, first, and then uh, we're hopefully gonna be able to do it. So, let me collect more trash. Not to mention, I really have to figure out how to do this, the clay pump. Oh, you know what? I think I can actually craft the clay pump here, but I just need the blueprint again. So they're gonna be able to make it. I'll get it now. And if I place a clay pump in that side, that's just gonna automatically pump clay for me. I'm gonna be able to collect it eventually, right? So I need quite a bit of blueprints. All right, well, in that case, uh, let's go and do the quest on this side. Tracked. Oh, hold up. I need one rope and uh, one of those. Okay, okay, okay. I think I have enough. I just gotta go in the chests. There you go, buddy. Hey, look at that. We got 15 stars now. Awesome. That is so cool that it works like this. Absolutely love it. Unfortunately, we cannot really sell anything anymore. I'm going to have to bring more goods. Uh, what did I have to do? I don't know. Let's try to figure it out. Uh, first of all, let's make a ton of these. 30 of them should do for now. Or maybe 40. Let's go with 40. There we go. Let those do their thing. Uh, this one is also going to have to do its thing because I'm going to need more paper eventually, I guess. Uh, for the crusher, crush 10 crystals. Okay. I could also make a ton of levitating potions to be able to sell them. There we go. So those are also going to be sold. Uh, I needed this. Okay, let's put this in here. Where's the other one? Did I leave it in this chest? I did not. Okay, that. Take this and unfortunately I don't have what I need to add in more. Okay.
Uh, yeah, I think I gotta make me the uh, resources that I need. So let me go in here and make one of these. I think I needed one only, right? Pretty sure about it. There we go. We can make it. I'm thrilled to announce that our university is finally resuming its work. Of course, none of it would be possible without all the hard work of a very special yodel. Me. <laughs> Well, I guess Tanti did help a bit. <laughs> so allow me to present the lecture about magic and culture of Niters from our star, Yodel. Okay, everyone watching, I can't back out now. Hi, I'm, gosh, I'm not that good at public speaking. So a lecture, right? Uh, we're doing it live. <laughs> talk about knitting, talk about friendship, talk about the festivals, talk about knitting. So knitting may seem hard at first, but the key is you do it one stitch at a time. Congratulations, you have received the Fallen Star. You can earn Fallen Stars by giving lessons in Bandler University or by completing a side quest. What? To customize your backpack using uh, outdoor buildings or outdoor building or let your imagination run free. Huh. So you can customize indoor or outdoor. Use the first tab to build different types of home decorations. Uh, you can spend Fallen Stars in the second tab to purchase customization sets. Uh, the last tab is used to customize your entire house. You can customize your wallpaper, bed, window, and so much more. That is so cool. Oh, can we? Ah, so if you want to have other lectures, because this one is complete as you all can see, uh, you need these materials. I get it. That is so cool. So for the other st uh, studies lecture, I need the poster which I have, I need the artifact which I have, and a blueprint. So once I figure out how to get the blueprints, I'm going to be able to hold a lot of lectures by the looks of it. Look at this. That is so cool. Man, there's going to be so many lectures I'm going to have to actually hold. Holy smokes. How was the lecture? Well, I always consider studying boring. How did my lecture change that? Well, nah, it turned out doing nothing is even more boring. <laughs> the lecture was fun though. I liked how it wasn't specific to science or art. Yeah, I'm really tired of that uh, rivalry. Well, maybe it's time to end it for good. How? Well, with a mixture for both departments. Hmm, you mean a party? Yeah, we should totally have a party right here under the unity tree. Yeah, that's the place where Ozzy had the best ones. Hmm. That's also where the catastrophe happens. I can fix it. I can fix it. <laughs> I can save everyone. That's better place not far from the secret hideout of yours. Let's meet uh, let's meet up by the flask. Huh. Oh, look at that, it's raining. It hasn't rained in here for quite a long time. Okay, so I'm guessing the flask is this one, and this is where we have to have the potty, right? Uh, let me get my stars. There we go. And we can actually have more of these levitating thingamajigs selling so we can get more stars. Uh, let me also go ahead and reset so we can get more points. There we go. I cannot wait to upgrade my house. Uh, let's collect these. Collect these. Collect this. We got five fallen stars, so many. So if I grab this and this, and I'm also gonna have a blueprint, I'm gonna be able to uh, keep another lecture. So, hold up. How do you upgrade the house? Wait, I can, seriously, I can upgrade again? I can go to sleep again? <laughs> Dang it, look at that, we got 20. That is awesome. Okay, we got that. Let's take these ones, add them back in again. I don't have anything to place in there for the fireflies, unfortunately. But I feel like I gotta hold a potty. That's what I gotta do. Okay, that one is done as well. We got this one that is completed. Uh, ooh, 75 stars. We got so many. Awesome. Okay, so. Uh, use. Big home upgrade. Speed vending upgrade. How do you get that bug thingamajig? Craft recipe. I don't even know how to make that. 
also at the same time i just gotta figure out how to so of course now you can roll and unroll this Hey, this one is rolling the uh, kitchen, of course, but I don't want the kitchen. I want the one for the festival to be activated. But I think for that, I gotta close the shop first. Yeah, because this is definitely not the uh, what I need. How do I upgrade? I want to customize the house, but I have absolutely no clue how to do it. Uh, throw student mixer at Bandle Center. Skill required. Student mixer. So I do have the student mixer one. Student mixer, right here. There we go. Okay, we got this one unlocked. Reinforced thread making. I cannot really activate that one, but I can activate this. The fine craft merchants. Okay. Which means I can probably upgrade this thing. Yeah, that's what probably this means. Uh... How do I make the blueprint? Oh, uh, I don't know how to make blueprints. Of course, I can go and... You know what? Let me go and buy some blueprints. Since I'm struggling so much with the blueprints, we definitely need to go and buy it. Throws to the mixer at Bundle Center. Okay, we are, we are. Give me a second. Let me buy blueprints. Oh, finally. Okay, so this one's giving me... So expensive. There we go. Oh, that was not the blueprints that I needed. <laughs> Take it. Oh man, I only got one. Uh, what is that though? Advanced blueprints. Well, I guess eventually I will need those advanced blueprints as well. Unfortunately, I messed it up. That's fine. That's fine. That is fine. So if I go in here, hey, look at that. We can make the small games table. Confetti cannon. Uh, carpet and rolls. Okay, so we got the big upgrade that we can make, which I most definitely want to make. Uh, let me unravel this. This one's for crafting stuff by the looks of it. Hey, look at this. This has expanded so much now. I love it. Um... Going here, move objects, and now I can move this bad boy over there. Finally, so much better. Okay, so we have that section, move objects. We now also have this section over here. There we go, and we can place so many more inside now. Uh, okay, let's also go in, remove objects, this one, because I want to place the loom inside over here instead. There we go. Perfect. Okay, that is done. Now, throws to the mixer at the bundle, fine vigor. My question is, how do I customize? I'm definitely doing something wrong here. Um, Fallen Star. Yeah, how do I use the Fallen Star to customize the house? That's what I want to do. Use. What? Oh, I think this is where you're making blueprints and posters. What? Look at that. I can make posters. Are you kidding me? Okay, I need more ink then. <laughs> how do you make ink? Um, I forgot how to make ink. I completely forgot how to make ink as well. Oh, ink right here. Okay, let's make one ink. Fortunately, I don't have what I need now. Because I can make another blueprint. So I can go here and make blueprints. Awesome. Okay, we got two blueprints. Perfect. Finally. So that's been figured out. Let's take this. Add more. So that part is completed. Uh, let's also get everything from the shop over here. 
And close it up. And now... How do we get the potty going? I don't have enough space to place this carpet. Uh, am I supposed to unroll this one first? Yeah, yep. Yeah. Okay, there we go. Throws to the mixer at the vandal center. New friends. Best. Start potty. Student mixer. There we go. So that's what I need. Conditions. Place. Uh, funky launch music. Laid back tunes. Brain boosting beats. Music with a fast rhythm. Loved by students for its simulating mental... Yes, that's what I want for sure. For the lights. A rhythm style of light. Rhythmic lights. Mystery lights. Soothing lights. Relaxing type of lights goes best with the calm rhythms. Mysterious style of lights fits mysterious rhythms. And rhythmic style of lights pulses to a fast beat. Uh, I'm gonna go with the mysterious ones, I guess. Arts students, science students, and Bjorn. No, we need the students one for sure. Um, science or this one? Price four. Guest number... Oh, I cannot activate it, though. For some reason. Neaters. What? I cannot activate. The only one that I can activate is Bjorn. Hold up a minute. Art students. And science students. There we go. Okay, okay, okay. That's more like it. Uh, so what do I do? To activate it? Reward. This has always kind of like been a little bit confusing to be honest. Try to figure out how to activate things. Uh, so I need three fire, three music, and three for people. Maybe I need to craft more stuff. Small game. Aha. Uh -huh. And confetti cannon, chill zone, and dance floor. Okay, hold up. We also need this one, I think. Uh, rotate. There we go. Okay, what about now? Uh, I still need I. So I still need one of these, maybe. Kind of like thingamajigs. Uh, which might be the confetti cannon. So I need one rock. Hold up. Let me make me one rock. Uh, I gotta go here. Let me make me a couple of rocks because we kind of like low on rocks here. Let's go with 20 rocks. Okay, let's uh, let that do its thing. Perfect. While that happens, let me collect some resources. Okay, let's grab the bug over here. There we go. Let's get more pieces of paper. Perfect. This is going to be such an awesome party. I cannot wait. Cannot wait to earn more stuff. Uh, oh, hold up. Can I not go here and collect stuff from these fellas? Yes, we can. More materials. Perfect. Nothing in their chest. Can I go inside the building? No. Alright, so once I'm going to get the rock from over here... I now can craft the confetti cannon. Awesome. It's going to go like that. I think it's done. I don't need anything else because I already have everything else. So I think we can now activate it. Oh, hold up. I have six fire now. Seriously? Uh, okay, in that case... How do I remove things? Um, go here. Oh, remove aura. Can I remove the aura from this? What? What is that? Move objects. Remove objects. Can I remove this then? Hey, now we can start it. There we go. All right, student mixer activates. Look at this thing. That is so cool. <laughs> oh man, this is lovely. All right, boost this guy up. Boost this guy up with music. 
Why am I not boosting? Boost these guys up as well. Grab you. Put it there. Grab you. Put it there. You as well. Put it in there. Boost this guy up. Perfect. There we go. Oh my god, we did so well. Was this perfect? Yes, it was. And we got the reward as well. Are those light bulbs? I think they are. You know me, Dr. Tangent. I'm not a boring person. <laughs> that is definitely not one of your problems, Dr. Alma. And yet, I can't remember the last time I've had this much fun. It was entertaining, yes. It got me thinking about this ridiculous competition of ours. How much fun are we missing because of our constant brickering? Maybe it's time we bury hatchets. I have to agree. Seeing everyone in Nida felt so productive. Then it settled. The departments are stopping our competition. Yay! Look at that. Well, it ain't saving Battle City yet. But stopping this feud is kind of impressive. Righty, are you trying to give me a compliment? <laughs> That's as close as you're getting to one. Take it or leave it. <laughs> Thanks, you cranky old sock. <laughs> Would like to thank you for such a fabulous body. Um, this? This did turn out to be useful. I'm glad to see you two finally getting along. But the knowledge collections are still missing, and I haven't found anything to help restore the portals. Well, we may know someone who can. We used to have a different uh, dean, Dr. Nestor. What's Dr. Nestor like? Very educated. He never needed any kind of knowledge collection. Where can I find him? Well, sadly, he left his past to dwell into the nature of, uh, well, nature. He wanted to be left alone, so we don't know his location. But I do. What? What? Do you know where the giant telescope is? I think so. Well, I was quite into maps before this whole thing. The telescope has a giant cave behind it. That's the most solitary place in the whole island. If, ne if Dr. Nestor is still on the island, he must be hiding in there. Thanks, I'll go look for him at once. Awesome. Okay, that was super cool. Um, the party is gonna have to be unraveled. Wait, what? Like that. This one is for the kitchen. The thing is, I could actually ho hold a kitchen event here. Uh, because if I do that, I'm probably gonna be able to get myself a ton of resources. More like points, actually, right? That I can go ahead and spend. So, let me get that. That. Okay. Uh, let me also grab the rocks while we add it. Oh gosh. We gotta go to sleep as well. Dream. I haven't upgraded the uh, house just yet still. Okay, that is done. Uh, oh, you know what? Two or more dishes, six or more, uh, four orders, workbench ready. So I gotta get this one activated. There we go. Awesome. And we're about to get ourselves a ton of stuff as well. There's the egg buddy. Uh, put it in there. Come on, come on, come on, faster. Come on. Ooh, almost lost it. That was awesome. There we go. Grab it, put it in the oven. He also wants the same thing. Grab it, put it in the oven, give it to this guy. I think I'm gonna do this one perfectly. Hold up a minute. There we go. Hey, we got it. Awesome. You need help? Great question. Are we always looking for assistance uh, or should we just talk through life alone? <laughs> I mean, do you need help with something right now? Oh, sure, I'd love some leaf plates. Huh, I'd love some leaf plates. Bring leaf plates to Mika. 
Interesting. Okay, we are gonna do that. I love that I managed to get myself my uh, resources here. I do have the leaf plates on me. So I'm just definitely gonna go ahead and deliver them. Uh, repair telescope ladder. So we also have to repair the ladder there somehow. Uh, I think I have the plates on me, right? Oh yeah, I do have the plates on me. Any reward, Firefly Lanterns, uh, Advanced Blueprint. I, I need the normal blueprint though, that's what I need. I need some normal blueprints. But in order to make normal blueprints, I may need ink, uh, which we no longer have. Flask workbench. Ooh, I don't have the flask workbench. Hold up a minute. We gotta make this one as well. Junk, junk. I already have that junk upcycler, so I don't need that. Spooling, loom, crusher workbench. We already have this one. And we already have that one as well. Okay. Hey, look at that. We can. Wait, isn't it the same thing? Oh, it is. <laughs> get uh we have we have the same thing so i gotta make me ink but the question is what is that black sand collectible and we have no clue where we can collect the black sands uh remove object this one there we go got the resources back Okay, I gotta find a way to get me the black sand from somewhere, but I have no clue how to get it. Uh, okay, I gotta bring this to Mika. So let's see if I can find Mika up here to bring in the plates. And I also have to go ahead and fix up the scope, which is this thing. The telescope looks kind of abandoned. Hmm, believe me, I know the feeling. <laughs> hey, I can fix it. Hey, hey, there we go. It's fixed. Okay, before I'm going to head inside, hold up. Give me a second. Let me have a quick chat with Mika and give her the plates or him. There we go. And now to test the ultimate theory. Is the plate half full or half empty? Here. Here, for your help. Thanks. Good luck with the theory. <laughs> awesome. We got this quest advanced a little bit more. Perfect. Uh, not to mention, I also need blueprints for this over here. Okay, I'm going to get me some blueprints so I can collect some clay from these spots. Let me see if I can buy some blueprints. I should have enough stars, right? Yeah, we have 37. We have enough for sure. So, hey, give me please some blueprints. Only one? Sure, I guess. Now I can make this. Oh, wait, what? What is that? Magic rubber. Dang it. So I need magic rubber to actually activate this thing. Oh, dang it. <laughs> Man. Why is everything requiring so much work? Uh, okay. I'm going to have to buy me more blueprints now. But for more blueprints, I need more parties and stuff. Activated. Because I do not have enough. Hold up. Um, reinforced thread making. Hmm. And untangle multi tool. Oh, we're about to make the untangle multi tool. Finally, we're getting close. We are getting close. Progressing into the world here is 
quite slow, of course. It takes a lot of work to get to the next stages. But finally, we made our way inside the scope. Oh, gosh. Whoa. Oh, that is so weird. We basically flipped on the other side, upside down. Are you kidding me? That is so cool. I still do not know how to interact with those portals. Anyway, let's collect some bananas. Hey, look at this guy. Who in the name of all the stars are you? Uh, my name is Tantin, and I came from the university. You're wasting your time. There's not even the faintest chance I'm coming back. But my best friend got trapped inside a portal, and only your knowledge can save her. Also, your experience within us and rugged good looks. <laughs> only a fool would fall for such an obvious flattery. What do you know about the catastrophe? Well, whatever your yodels did was massive. I've been studying portals for half of my life, yet I've never heard of anything like that. That's the most accurate scientific opinion I can give you with the information I have. I was right there when it happened. I can provide any kind of information you need. Hmm, your how I spend my vacation essay wouldn't give me so much to work with. So what exactly would you need? Well, you're not going to leave me alone, are you? <laughs> nope. Fine, then fetch me a weather report. As you know, Banda City is peered with magic winds. A weather report can help us find where they are the strongest. I'll get you whatever you need, but I need to report back to Tristana first. Good. Now leave before I change my mind about helping you. <laughs> hey, we're about to also get this quest unlocked as well. Oh, I can also bring my home here as well. Huh. Repair. There you go, buddy. Let's fix these up. There you go. All right. That's going to grow up. And I think that's about it. I wonder what's up with the portals, though. I can't do anything with this now. Oh, maybe I don't have because I don't have the backpack on me. That's why, yeah. Oh, and also if I go here, look at that. The rain is falling upside down. That is so cool. Man, this game. This game is really, really awesome. Uh, what if I go in here and I make a lot of these potions? Because if I sell them, I'm going to get me a lot of stars, which means blueprints. Okay, so I'm going to need a lot of that stuff as well. I'm going to have to craft back. Okay, let's sell those. Uh, okay, what do I need? Find Vigor. I haven't really found Vigor right here, though. Now, my question is, how do I get me... That tool again. Workbench. I feel like I gotta make me more wood. I'm kind of running low on wood here. Okay, let's do that for now. Uh, let's also make a couple of these. Conductor. Now, my question is How do I make me one of those spool thing about jigs? This one. So, we got a repair multi tool, but I need a, another tool that I want to place inside. Uh, and I have no clue how to craft it. Oh, this one can be uh, unlocked as well. The Yolk Buds. Ground Salt as well. Yeah, these ones cannot be uh, collected. But I can get the Yolk Ball at least. And then the Grub Masher for more food pieces. More food meats, more money. Okay. Speedy Goods Merchant and uh, Untangle Multi-Tool. That's the one that I want. So I got to save my points here for that.
Uh, this one is the repair multi tool. Which you don't need just yet. These ones as well, I'm gonna place over there for now. Okay, perfect. Uh, let's also get rid of that. I don't think I need it on me. Okay, cool. That's done for now. Um, find bigger. I feel like I may just need to go to a new location. But at the same time, I also have to report to her. Apparently, I cannot report to her. Never mind. Uh, and if I want to hold another one of these, I need, of course, uh, blueprints. Dang it. How much money do we have? 27. I think I might be able to get me another blueprint here. Hold up. Let's go get a blueprint real fast. Now, one thing that I also have to do is the right tool in order to collect more sand. I kind of forgot how I did this one, this dust scooper. And I don't know how to make it again. Um, how do you make the dust scooper? Cloth, big home upgrade. So in here, I gotta get the untangled multi-tool, right? But how about the dust scooper? Oh, right here. Oh, no, that's a different one. Okay, the scooper right here. How do you make it? I should be able to just craft it, but I have no clue why I cannot craft it for some reason. Shop and get myself another blueprint. Man, these blueprints are quite expensive. I feel like we should also go through the portals to try to find bigger. Because this is our next mission. We kind of done everything that we had to do over here. I don't want to sell the Firefly Lanterns for sure. But I do want to get more money. Uh, I could hold another kitchen event. Yeah, I could definitely do that. Okay. If I'm going to hold it, hold up. Let me get the ingredients that I need. Uh, which are these, these. And of course, this one to activate it. Maybe these for making plates. Yeah, let's try to make a couple more plates here. Okay. Plates. Two, three, four, five. Six plates should do. And probably gonna need this one. Okay, let's start it up. There we go. We need stars. I need more stars. I need so many more stars. Okay, what do you guys need? First order of the day is a pie. Come 
Come on, come on, come on. I need actually so many pies. Wait, why can I not... Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Why am I not getting any pies here? How do you make the pies? Is it with this guy? Oh, it's this guy, and I had to put it... Dang it, I messed it up. No, uh... I messed it up. Unfortunately, I messed it up. Unfortunately, I kind of messed it up. I messed up two of them because I had no idea how to do the pies. I completely forgot about the pies. The pies are the eggs, actually. Okay, that's completed. Let's grab these ones real fast. So I could try to do it again if I want to. So, again. Let's do that and that. Alright, let's hold another event here. Oh, I cannot. Never mind. Take it. I wasted it. <laughs> That's fine. That's fine. Uh, in that case, let me hold a different festival this time. Get all those stars. Which is going to be a party. Yeah, let's hold a party. So, this party is going to be for New Friends Fest. Funky launch music, laid back tunes. Soothing or mystery? Let's go with soothing. And I want to go with Bjorn. Yeah, sure. Let's also bring the students as well. Uh, we cannot do it because we need a little bit more music. So, what I got to do, I got to remove this one. So, let me go for decorations. Remove this. And small drinks table. I need something for music, right? Oh, nothing at... Oh, the dance floor is bringing me music. Also, the sun trumpet. Wait, what? What is that? What is this? Conductive wires. I have no idea how to make that. So I could make either another one of these dance floors, but I do not have any more sand. Hmm. So unfortunately, we cannot hold this event. Unless... I remove that, I guess, right? Oh, nope. That doesn't work either. Never mind. Hmm. So if I... I gotta create something for bodies in order to hold this event. Which, unfortunately, we do not have at the moment. All right, that's fine. Uh, we have 19 stars so far. Gotta get me more materials if I want to continue the adventure here. The thing is I want to try to sell more stuff. That's what I want to do. And unfortunately, I cannot really sell that much stuff. The Scooper multi-tool. Fortunately, we cannot craft it either. Speedy vending machine. Confetti cannon. Assembly bench. I already have the assembly bench right in here. I do not have the assembly bench. So that is one of the things that I actually needed. Flask, junk, spooling bench, loom, crusher, and the bug thingamajig. Hit the conductor and that is about it. Small drink table, we already have. These ones are for the parties and the events, yeah. Okay, hold up. And this one. Wow, look at this. We can make pepper boats. I have no idea what that is, but I think we can sell them. Which might actually be super cool to make. I'm pretty sure you can make a shop and sell all these boats, right? Let's see if that's possible. So if I open up the shop, hey, you can sell these ones. Look at that. So I'm just going to sell one and let it do its thing. That is awesome. 
Uh, other than this, you can make butterfly knots that you can also sell. It would be awesome if I could actually tell this one to make a lot of butterfly knots. But apparently that is not possible. I feel like this one is more advanced than the... Oh, you know what? We also have to make a lot of these things. Using beats. Because now that we got that going, I can activate this. There we go. Right, that's completed. Um, so much work. Let's grab the banana. Let's grab this. Okay. All right, that's completed. Perfect. Uh, what did I wanted to do? I wanted to actually go to sleep, so we can get more XP, of course. And now. Let's see if we can unlock something new in the skill tree. Okay, this one is still locked, unfortunately. So we gotta go to knitting. I still have to figure out how to make me the dust scooper tool back again. I have no clue how to make this uh, thing again. Catalyst sand gathering, okay. Collect different types of sand and dust. I mean, I'm yeah, making this one using wood and the dust that I have. Dust scooper multi-tool. Collect different types of sand and dust. And I'm making it at a workbench level 1. What? This one, right? Right here. Oh, thank you, dude. That's what I needed. <laughs> okay, now we have it. And assembly bench. Oh, I transformed into an assembly bench. Thank it. Which means I can destroy the other one. Never mind. Okay. I didn't know you can upgrade things. Yeah, look at that. You can actually upgrade things. What? Junk up cycle level 3 if I want, if I have what I need, actually. So I need a uh, junk up cycler. Wait, what? Five. Aha. Uh -huh. So I need five of these. I guess I, I need four. This one as well I could upgrade. Nope. And I cannot upgrade this one either. But this one I can upgrade. But I don't have what I need to upgrade it. Okay, let that do its thing. Uh, ooh. Repair multi-tool and this one, which I already have. So now I can go ahead and get me more sand. Because I should have the tool. There we go. There's so many uh, menus in this game, it's it's quite easy to get lost in these menus eventually, for sure. That's what happened to me, I really got lost into the menus. Not getting an XP out of this, but that's fine, because all I need is the uh, sand. I'm just gonna get... A little bit of sand here. Let's go with 30 sand, should be enough for now. Oh, it already broke, never mind. <laughs> that's fine. Oh, hold up. Just noticing a little bit of this. Perfect. I don't know how that thing spawned in there, but uh, I definitely needed that. Can I go in this structure? Now, if I go into this, I should be able to unlock more things. So, uh, let's unlock the food here. This one as well. These ones are locked, so I cannot get these achievements, unfortunately, yet. Unless I unlock new festival cards, vendors. 
Oh, I gotta find Bager to unlock this. Okay, okay, okay. That is good to know. This one is still selling, and it's selling like crazy. Love it. Look at that. I'm getting a lot of stars. And I can also go ahead and get myself another blueprint, because I definitely need those blueprints. Oh, another one of these. Awesome. Yeah, I was really, really looking for black sand that didn't spawn in anymore. And I think now the black sand is spawning exactly where those uh, stars were falling, right? Yeah, look at that. That's exactly where they spawned again. So I can go back to the location where the star were and uh, collect me more. There we go. Oh, what about this spot? Isn't Vega going to be here, I wonder? Pretty sure he will. Pretty sure he's going to be here. Weird. Seems like Vigor isn't home. Now, that's a monkey business, if you ask me. Maybe he went shopping or something? Hmm, maybe, but he's on my watch list. <laughs> Come on, we got a ton of other stuff to do. Hey, there we go. This quest has advanced a little bit more. Unlocks new festival cards, vendors. So, next up, I gotta just talk to Tristana, since we know that Vigor is not here. Oh, at it. I'm also going to make my way on this side. Like some of this. Unfortunately, I still cannot interact with this because I do not have what I need. But I got to get me another blueprint right on this side from her. Shop. Blueprint. There we go. Thank you very much. What are you selling, buddy? Nothing that I need at the moment, at least. Hey, we can finally talk to her. Uh, I've I've questioned the yodels like you asked, so what can you tell me? I still don't know how to save Ozzy and Clover, but uh, about the Bandle Center. Most yodels have been fretting about the broken portals and the rubbles on the islands, but I think the student mixer has somewhat improved the moods. Hmm, got it. Great intel. About the university, the department are ending their rivalry because of the party. Also, classes are beginning again, but all the knowledge collections are lost. I'm the only one who has given any lecture so far. Well, I wouldn't have pegged you for a lecture, but reuniting those two factions is even more impressive. Good job, Stanton. But we need to find someone else to help us with the portals. Gunnar's camp is still on the lockdown. They won't let me in. Hmm, well, that martial law thing is based on Temo's scout codes. Even if I can breach that, you're gonna have to find Temo himself. They may have taken my order, but the Yodels, uh, they really idolize uh, Temo. I found the old Dian, Mr. Nestor. We're lucky that he's still around, he seems really smart, but he needs some kind of a weather report to help us. No way you find them. I was wondering where he went. Uh, take me to him. Let's see what we need exactly. <laughs> oh man, I love that this place is upside down. It's just awesome. What are you guys doing here? There's no way you could have gotten that report already. The whole point was that you'd leave me alone. And you brought someone else here? How dare you. You're just as cranky as I remember, Nestor. <laughs> Wait, Triss? Is that you? How lovely to see you! I would have come sooner if I told me where you were. Well, I apologize for that, but I need my solitude. Believe me, Nestor, we wouldn't disturb your peace if it wasn't serious. Can you help us? Like I told your colleague before, I need data. Without it, it's just reading the tea leaves. I can vouch for Stanton. If anyone can get your data, it's them. I'm ready to collect any kind of data you need, as soon as you tell me what data it is. Still sure about the vouching, Trish? <laughs> He, uh, a fast learner. Luckily for this fast learner, uh, the device you need uh, tracks magic wind automatically. I call it the magic uh, galliometer. You just need to build it. How do I build a galliometer? Well, I'll uh, get you the schematics. As for where you should build it, I recommend the roof of your house. 
Not only that it's practical, but it's also really pretty. Huh. So basically he gave me another uh, thingamajig that I can place on the house. You unlock the gallery meter. Now you can add magical auras to workbenches. First, attach the workshop carpenter or gallery meter to your workbench using the outdoor building menu. Then choose the aura you want to send them from the number of available auras in the islands. Motion aura or precision aura. You can choose a grid square to send the aura to. Hmm. You can also build workbenches on top of the existing auras. Green sprout bridge seeds. Upgrade your galio meters to unlock more advanced auras. Interesting. Hey, this one is completed. We got a new badge completed. Awesome. We've actually done so many things. I'm not going to even plant anything here because I have my own farm back home. I fixed it. That's all I wanted. So now, if I go and get my backpack back, I should be able to uh, build whatever they're asking me to build. Let's see. And at the same time, I can also grab this and place another one. Use. What the heck? How do I get that bug thing in my jig? I don't know how to get that one. Assembly bench. Spooling bench. Spooling bench 2. Crusher. Small drinks. Confetti cannon again. Oh, the grub masher. Look at that. But how do I get those materials though? Hmm. This is not as easy as I would have preferred it to be. Hey, this is how you decorate. There we go. Finally, we can decorate. Uh, backpack color. Quirky home set. What? Lulu home set. And rumble home set. We have... We need so many... Actually, we have enough stars. Never mind. Vigor home set. Yumi home set. Uh, I guess I... Activate a Yumi home set. Although I have no idea how that looks. Wait, how do you activate the Yumi home set? I don't even know. Assembly bench, junk, junk up skiller 2. Haven't I already upgraded this one to jump up skiller 2? I definitely have, right? So, how do I get the bug thing in my jig? This one. Oh, I think I gotta unlock it. That's what I gotta do, yeah. So if I go into here, there we go. Emotion orb, orb upgrade. Uh, oh, this is giving us two emotion orb upgrades added. And we can also make the charge workbench. What? But what I needed was... Which one? Student mixer, we know that. The untangler multi-tool as well can be made. Are you kidding me, game? Jeez, the thing is I'm going to need a lot of points. The thing is... So as this is collecting resources, going to start selling. Uh, we got to exp... Not that. I actually want to expand a different one. Hold up. Um, I'll roll that one. I wanted this one. Okay. So in here... I got to make the magic galio meter. But I need a different type of thing that I do not have, unfortunately, at the moment. And I can also make a basic workbench that I can place in here. For example, like that. And a chest if I get some wood. Let's get 10 wood going over there. Let's get this one built up. Okay. Uh, I need also wood upgraded, which we are going to get very soon. Unfortunately, I'm also going to go through blueprints, which I don't really like. But that's fine because I'm going to also make two blueprints over here. Just like that. Come on, buddy. Hurry up. Hurry up. Okay, there we go. Got that going. And we can now make this one into a better thing of my jig. All right. And I think I also want to have a chest over here, but I need two wood. We're getting there. Okay. 
Come on, buddy. Give me that thing. I still don't know how to interact with the little guys. I still got to figure that out. Uh, chest. Right here. There we go. All right. Perfect. And now, of course, you can place things inside. Uh, let's go with this menu. Let me also get this thing into my inventory. The magic galio meter. Wait, I already have this. So how do I... I don't have to build it. That's the thing. Right? Yeah, I don't have to build it. Craft recipe. I already have it. How do I place it? That's my question. Nature. This is the one that I need. I need nine. So I just need a couple more points to unlock the spotty hunting. Once I get that one, I'm probably going to be able to get me specific bugs. I get it now. Well, in that case, uh, let me go to sleep and reset. Uh, let's also grab the wood while we're at it. Unfortunately, we're only down to six. I need more. So we have more stars. Roll this carpet. How do I get the whole thing? No. There we go. I just wanted to get the whole backpack with me. Because I'm actually planning to use the portal. Okay. So, the thing is, I gotta finish with the Magic Galio meter. But, in order to place this one, I need the upgrade. And in order to get the upgrade, I need to keep on collecting more stars here. So I need to keep on doing stuff just to collect XP. That's all I got to do, basically. So I could also make, let's say, the levitating thingamajigs, for example, because these are also giving us XP. Sell them off as well to get more money. Or more like stars, because that's uh, how the money is represented in this game. It's through stars. So I ultimately have to collect stuff constantly. You know, to keep on getting XP. The thing is, as you guys can see, nothing that I'm doing right now is giving me XP anymore. This is not giving me XP. So I'm not really getting any more XP, unfortunately. I can't do anything with this now. So I gotta find a way to get more XP. I don't know what to do. I'm not quite sure. Because I've kind of done everything. Oh, you know what I should do? I should try to hold another one of these Yaddle Studies, because I do have enough stuff. So yeah, let me go ahead and do this one. Why not? Why not? So if I go in here, I can grab this bad boy, this bad boy, or at least I can grab just one, not all of it. There we go. And let me hold another study here. There we go. Awesome. Interact. Oh, and I did get uh, a mage cap. <gasps> can I actually put that mage cap on? I wonder. Oh, man, that would be so cool if I can. Uh, how do you customize the character? Hey, I can put the mage cap on. No way. Look at this. <laughs> oh, that is awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. All right, well, there we have it, guys. This is going to be the end of this episode of Bandletail. I'm absolutely loving how this game is. It's just super detailed. There's so many things to do, so many places to visit. I love it. I absolutely love this. Such an amazing little game. Uh, I cannot wait to keep on playing some more. So uh, if you guys are enjoying this one as much as I am, make sure you like down below. Uh, let me know in the comments below what you think about the game. And uh, I will see you all in the next one soon. Bye, everyone.